Welcome to TamsGuitar.com and we are going to take a look at the intro finger style riff of the song called One Last Breath by Creed. So it starts off with your first finger on 2nd fret 1st string and I hope that you people are all prepared for this and you know how to play finger style because this is not for beginners. Anyway, so you look at my right hand, I'm keeping my thumb on the 4th string and third finger on the first string you can use the second finger as well to start off so the first thing is you plug the fourth and the first string together you can either use your second finger for the first string or third finger the more conventional approach so you plug these two together then the bass fourth string then you put your fourth finger on first string fifth thread you pluck it with the help of your second finger or third finger whatever is comfortable to you sometimes I'm using the second finger so then after plucking the first string I'm again plucking the fourth string open so then I'm plucking the fourth string and the first string open then I'm hammering on to the second fret first string so so far then I'm putting my second finger on second string third fret and plucking it now you plug the fifth string open and after that you play second string second fret second string third fret and then from 3rd fret to 5th fret you hammer on so after hammering on you again play the 5th string open so again so after the hammer on you play the 5th string open and then immediately you pull off from the 5th fret to the 3rd fret then pull off to the 2nd fret. Let's join this. So it's a bit tricky when slowed down, you don't get the feel. Let's join now. Once again. Then again, after pulling off, you play the third fret second string all right once you start playing then it will come to a flow then you hold B minor and play the the fifth and the third string together with the help of your thumb and middle finger and again after plucking these two together you play the fifth string then you play the second string with the help of your third finger then again fifth string so these two fifth string second string fifth string then you remove the middle finger from the second string and plug the second string and then hammer on to the third fret all right once again sorry then with the help of your second and first finger you play the third and fourth string all right let's join this Then you hold G major and play the 6th string, then 6, 4, 3, 4, 6, 4, 3, 4, thumb 1, 2, 1, then 2, 3, 6, 4, 3, 4, 2, 3, 2 is with the help of the second finger and 3 is with the help of first finger. So it goes in a flow.
then you play first string 6 4 3 4 2 3 1 and then you put your first finger on the F sharp note that is second fret first string and play the first string so this part then again it goes back to the initial part After you plug the second fret, you again put your thumb on the fourth string and middle finger on the first string and plug them together. And then again you plug the fourth string like we did in the first part. So let's join from the beginning. So once we reach here, we play like this, you play the 4th string and the 1st string together, then the 4th string, then you put your 2nd finger on 1st string, 3rd fret, then again the bass note, again 1st string, 2nd fret, then you play first string open and hammer on to the second fret and pull off all right like this so let's join from this part then you put your second finger on third fret second string put your third finger on the fourth string sorry it's a fourth fret fifth string it's a bit of a stretch strings keeping rather all right do it once again then after this you play the fifth string open and bar the second fret from fourth string to second string so let's join. So after playing the 5th string open, I'm playing the 4th string with the help of my thumb and 3rd and 2nd string with my 1st and 2nd finger. So. After I play the second string, I again play the second string and this time I hammer and pull off on the third fret. So, alright. So after you hammer on and pull off to the third fret second string, then you play the third string second fret and play the second string open. And it goes in a flow so it matches. Actually, I forgot whether these two notes are there or not. You please check with the audio and see whether it works or not. You have to listen carefully. If you are not that good guitar player, then definitely you won't be able to understand whether these two notes are there or not. Just give it a try. Learn this because it's more important to learn the technique and then later on you can check. All right. So then third string, second fret and then second string open. Then after that immediately you go to B sus2. B sus2 is like this. You play B minor without the second finger and here and here I think they play the pattern like this. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 2, 3, 2, thumb, thumb, 1, 2, 3, 2, 1, 2, the right hand finger numbers I'm talking about. Thumb, thumb, 1, 2, and then you go to G bar chord. Then in G you play 6, 5, 4, 3, 1, 2, 3, 2. 6, 5, 4, 3, 1, 2, 3, 2. So do it 
very slowly and once you develop the speed gradually then you'll get the feel all right so watch it over and over and do it very slowly and break it down into pieces and then learn thanks for watching and do like us on facebook and twitter where there are pages in the name of tams guitar and also mail me at info@tamsguitar.com if you have any queries and if you like this video please subscribe to my channel share it with your friends who are in need see you next time bye bye